Well, several new regulations in China take effect today, including a visa rule that is now a new category, R visa, to attract more foreign talents into this country. Well, there were about tougher penalties for those people who overstay their visas. As Teresa Su reports, many applicants and lawyers are just confused. For 20 years, Gary Chadaro has been representing thousands of clients to obtain work visas and residence permits. He says the new visa category R for high caliber overseas talents is a step forward for China. And uh, we're in a global talent war. Every country wants to have the most uh, advanced uh, uh, labor sector and China wants to do the same thing. Visa R refers to high-level, high-skilled professionals with five years' experience and in short supply. Further qualifications are still pending. Others will apply for the existing Z visa. Legal representatives say the rules between types R and Z are blurry. American Tyler Berry isn't sure where he fits in. He's on a student visa and has a job offer from a local law firm. I've been trying to do research on um, information about the new laws and how they will affect me and how I can easiest or most easily transition to a Z visa. I've done a lot of research online, but it's very unclear in the English-speaking world um, most of the information about these laws and what they entail. More questions for Barry, as all applicants must prove they have no criminal record. There, there is no specific uh, criteria for the criminal records, which is acceptable for the PRC government checking, so which is very difficult for Chinese lawyers to explain to our potential clients or clients. Liu says he's losing business. His law firm isn't representing clients for work visas until there is a clear picture. One thing that is clear, though, foreign talents qualify for the R visa will see a shorter process, one and a half months compared to two months for the Z visa. Three other types are also introduced. M replaces the current F for business and commercial visits, Q for family reunions, S for private visits, such as divorce, inheritance, adoption, marriage, or medical services. Legal experts say the new regulations are China's way to tackle overstays for foreigners. Thousands of cases have been reported. Now we can detain and expel those who have been involved in illegal employment. This was not clearly addressed in previous regulation. It will now take foreigners 15 days or more to renew their residence permits. Comes the new rules, comes harsher penalties. Anyone illegally employed will face a maximum fine of 20,000 renminbi, risk deportation and a possible five-year block from entering China. Overstayers pay a 10,000 maximum. Tracy Siu, CCTV, Beijing.